Hi everybody and welcome back to um, your favorite, hopefully your favorite, online motoring talk show, Talk the Talk. Thank you so much for joining me on another empowering episode of Talk the Talk. Get ready as I, Dish Balevichin, your host, welcome an exceptional FNI team leader to the studio with her expert financial knowledge and exceptional leadership skills. She is driving her team towards unprecedented success. Her ability to navigate um, complex transactions and deliver personalized solutions is what sets her apart. And her unwavering dedication to customer satisfaction and her innovative approach are reshaping the FNI landscape, uh, making her an invaluable asset um, in the motoring industry. Now, I believe she's also one of our nominees, uh, actually, our semi finalist for the Motoring Woman of the Year Awards. So, without further ado, let's Let's welcome Chandra Clover and she is the FNI team leader at We Buy Cars Head Office. And as always, this interview is proudly brought to you by Seriti Solutions, MFC and Evo by Netbank. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm well and you. I am so proud of you. Thank well you. done for Thank reaching you. the semi-finals. Thank you. Okay, so um, tell us about your journey in the motoring trade so we can get you even more votes. No and problem. I know you've got a lot of votes already. <laughs> no problem. So please tell us. <laughs> so I started in 2010 at SA Taxi. Mm-hmm. SA Taxi, uh, as you all well know, they sell taxis. Wow, that was in 2010. Yes, 2010. Okay. Mm-hmm. I worked there for about five five years. In I did all types of roles in SA Taxi, from uh-huh. capturing applications uh-huh. to contracts to payouts. Mm-hmm. Um, then from there I worked at Chocolate Cars, also finance, doing private finance for about three years. From there in 2019, March, I started at We Buy Cars. I mm-hmm. started at the F, as an FNI assistant. Mm-hmm. Um, I worked as an FNI assistant for three months, three grueling months. After that, I've got I got promoted to an FNI business manager. And uh, in my first month, I won the top achiever for uh, selling um, VAPS, um, your APU. Mm-hmm. And then after that, I've just been also winning like the top three for selling um, the most uh, VAPS as well as um, the units made. Uh, yes. Well, we buy cars. And Fan and Dirk van der Valt, the owners of Rebuy Cars, yes. are very blessed to have you. Thank you. <laughs> um, Chandra, and you know, that's the reason you're here. It's because of all of your accomplishments. We only have the best of the best in the top, I would say, 200. We have 6,000 nominations. So, well done, um, you. you know, for all your achievements. And that's why we are here, to recognize your achievements and, yes. and to celebrate you and your contributions to motoring South Africa. So the reason you accepted this nomination is because you have, you are aware of what we do. Yes. We are here to celebrate each other, to yes. champion for each other. How do you feel about this platform? I feel that this platform is very encouraging mm-hmm. and motivating for women and all people because it's not just about the women but especially for us mm-hmm. it gives us a platform to help each other mm-hmm. to to guide each other yeah. Yeah. and um, just knowing that this platform is here it gives you it encourages you to, to to be a better you so that absolutely. you can be an example for all young women absolutely and who inspires you though and why my mother Aww. my mother inspires me I get you can cry. You can cry. I have some. I have some tissues over here. No, it's Um, it's go ahead. (laughs) Do your thing, girl. I guess the interview wouldn't be uh, the interview without me crying. Oh, please listen. I'm also a crier, so go for it. So my mother, she's she's my coach. Uh, She's guided me thus far. She's also in the motor industry. Mm -hmm. Uh, With her guidance and her blessings, I can say I am where I am today. Oh, that's so sweet and. How do you handle a difficult customer, being a female especially? Yeah, especially, yes. Yeah. So with <laughs> especially difficult... with a business like We Buy Cars, yes. it's not your typical dealership yes. um, and you have a lot of different types of people yes. walking in. How do you uh, do this? So I've learned uh, you need to speak less and listen more oh, wow. because 
clients need to be feel they need to feel that they are heard. Mm -hmm. So if you give them the opportunity to let them vent and tell you how they're feeling, mm -hmm. that helps them feel heard. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. And um, what is something that you are really, really proud of, and why? So I'm proud of um, the woman I am today because I choose uh, to educate myself and um, to continuous develop my skills mm -hmm. so um, that I can be more of an asset for myself and in the workplace. Absolutely. Um, any words, or oh, before I even get to that, I just want to ask you, have you faced a situation of discrimination, uh, especially being female, and how did you handle it? No, I have not. That's amazing, no. and that's very refreshing. Yes. <laughs> I mean, if you started in the trade in 2010 and you haven't at all, really it gives us hope that yes. uh, that really there are good men out there that really, um, you know, champions for us. And I know that for sure that yes. they are, yes. but it's nice to hear it from other people. And so, any words of advice for women that want to join our trade? I would say that you should go for it. Don't give up. Go for your goals. Whatever it is that you want to do, don't let any negativity get into your mind. If you just focus on what it is that you want, you will get there and you will get there and you will do it. If you just believe that you can do it, you will. Absolutely. I just want to say, Chandra, well done on uh, reaching the semifinals. Hopefully you'll get to the finals. And um, thank you for joining our movement because this is what it's all about. It's about having conversations and encouraging anybody that might be watching this. So yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Ladies, in light of what uh, Chandra and I spoke about now, I just want to uh, add a quote um, to this conversation. It says here, when I let go of what I am, I become what I might be. So ladies, you are a powerhouse of untapped potential. It is so important to believe in yourself, um, embrace the challenges as opportunities and unleash your inner light. Uh, your unique talents and strengths will propel you to, to greatness. So embrace your journey, create the life you desire and make a lasting impact on the world. Remember, you are unstoppable. A quote from my guru, uh, Sadhguru, your Potential is beyond your imagination. Don't limit yourself by doubting uh, your capabilities. Once you tap into the boundless source of energy within you, there is no limit to what you can achieve. And with that, I would like to end off this interview by reminding you that the question should never be, who is going to let me? It should always be, who is going to stop me? Mm -hmm.